Hey Minecrafters, welcome back to the channel into the second video in my solo Minecraft series. Um, as you guys could hear, I'm still a little bit sick. I apologize. I did mention in the comment section of the last video that um, I might not get a video out this week, but I wanted to try to get one out anyway. So again, I do apologize if I sound a little more congested than usual. Um, but yeah, uh, as you can see, I'm in the same spot <laughs> as I uh, ended with last time, but didn't really get a chance to do anything so we're just gonna continue together and have some fun get up to, to some antics and explore and see what we can find so i hope everyone is having an awesome day slash week and a very happy holiday so far and yeah let's get on with the video all right so i can't even begin to think of where i want to start <laughs> my brain is so mush right now um oh i guess i should empty my backpack and just get rid of some of this stuff so we can go and explore a little bit um i guess i should kind of like make a little bit of a goal for myself today i do know i need to find some more iron and some more coal um oh gosh <laughs> you can tell i have so many different worlds because i can't remember what box is for what and what goes where um uh, so i guess here i'm gonna keep the armor and stuff with that enchants on it because i'm gonna yoink off some of those enchants once i get a grindstone set up okay so i'm gonna keep that i'm gonna keep that did I make... I thought I made a lava bucket. Oh, I did. Okay, so we're that's just looting one, right? We're gonna get rid of that. Such a handy little thing that charm adds that you can um, use the lava bucket as a garbage can, especially early game. I don't think there's trash cans in this. No, and I don't think there's like any type of like garbage disposal. No. Okay, so that's handy to have. So I guess we can just make some pants and uh, almost like a sweater. <laughs> oh boy, my brain. This. Oh, I forgot it's the bottom one. Go. Wait, what was that? Iron plating. Cool. There we go. Alright little buddy, well, you can stay in there, come out, but I am gonna go and adventure a little more. So where did we end up? Oh, I think that's one of those like pillager, like fancy pillager mansion thingamabobs over there. Nowhere near ready for that. Um, yeah, we didn't really get very far. <laughs> she says, oh yeah, well we did, we, we traveled up here to find this but other than that we haven't really gone anywhere um can we go east a little bit i'll cut these trees down when i get back this pretty pretty white oak wood let's see what we can find over here um this way Ba -ba -da -ba. Oh, there's those logs. Oh, oof. Yeah, that those. Oh my gosh, those logs give my computer a little bit of a struggle for whatever reason. Very bizarre. Very very bizarre. Okay. Um, I guess we'll keep going this way. There's gotta be a village around here somewhere. See, this one doesn't lag me out. It just seems to be the the one with the moss on it. Because that was the one that lagged me out in the first episode, too. Which was very weird. See, this building over here... Um, where'd it go? I just saw it. This building right here. Has a bunch of bone pillars, which I really want to loot. Oh, it's got all the uh, terraria, terrestria, terraria, whatever it's called, um, rainbow trees. They're kind of ugly to looking at like that, but they uh, they make some really pretty furniture. Oh, that! I know there's so many baddies in there. I just want those bones. <laughs> I want the bone blocks for bone meal. I don't know if I can get close enough, and I don't really have vein miner on right now. So, well, no, I don't really. I don't have vein miner on we've just started so 
I think I'm gonna leave this and just I don't really need to mark it it's pretty obvious what it is but go a bone building so we know where we can get some bone meal so I might grab one of these trees the thing about these two with the uh, tree capitator it isn't tree capitator it's like tree fall down mod or whatever it is it doesn't really work as well with these as you can see um i just want one of the saplings though but yeah they're they're really pretty like when the, the planks and stuff but this is just kind of odd looking to me i still haven't gotten a sapling though which uh what i came here for a sapling Yib. These are all too big. Um, they're all too close together and I don't feel like going to the top and grabbing the rest of the tree. So maybe I can find like a smaller one. Oh wait, there we go. Okay, it gave me one. <laughs> Asking you shall receive. So let's go and try to find... A village. Oh, that is a big ravine. Oh, I guess there's water in it. That's not too bad, but I still don't want to try to weasel my way out of it. So, there we go. Easy peasy. Oh, the ambiance is beautiful, though. There's a lot of updates that just uh, really hit it out of the ballpark. Sounds beautiful. I live in a city, so I don't get a lot of this beautiful nature ambiance. Just a bunch of annoying pigeons. So what is this? Oh. Is that? Oh yeah, that's a, a zombie village. So that's not going to have a waste of. I'm not even going to bother going over there because I don't feel like fighting anything at the moment. I just really want a waystone. Oh boy, that's a lot of uh, pillagers. Okay, uh, so I guess I can go down and around. Go down this way. And go, ooh. There we go. Hello bees, I see you. I don't need you right now, but hello. I don't have silky touch, so I can't uh, Grab your, your bees nest right now. Another one of those flipping windmills. Oh my god. Hey burps. Um, I'm gonna grab one of those. I got these carrots. Trading. Um, I only need to get one of those for now because I can bone meal them. Which is super duper handy. gonna be quite a day of uh, running around adventuring. Now I see more paths up here so is this gonna be another pillager one? Let's see. There's gonna be a villager one. I don't even know what they're called like not outposts but like camps I guess. Let's see. I just have to keep an eye out for a mountain as well. Because that'll be a good place to get some iron and coal. Oh, yeah, no, that is a whole other pillager area, so nope. Let's go this way. And I don't like to pre-generate chunks because just in case, like, there's some, like, uh, biome updates, which is quite frequent um, a lot of the time. I don't want to have a whole bunch of chunks pre-generated and then... Um, Lose out on the ability to get that stuff. Ooh, 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 village. So I saw the waystone over here somewhere. There it is. I will gladly grab that, please and thank you. I can't remember if I... I thought I had two, but I could be wrong. Let me just... Oh, I did, yeah. So I think this one here is another, like, uh, continue one that I had. Okay, all right. So maybe I do have one in the wilderness somewhere that I don't remember where I put it. Uh, I guess we'll have to go find that. Oh, there's an all-white kitty. Hello, baby. 
Oh, you're so cute. When I make my mob catchers, I will be back for you. Or, well, probably not to this specific one, but you know. I'll try to find another white one. So, we got a waystone. Perfect. Now, do I want to keep adventuring and finding... Ooh, what's down here? That's a little close to the windmill, but I kind of want to see what that is. It could be nothing, but it could be something, you know? Let's do that. Okay. What's this? Oh, right, 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 right. Okay, what is this? Is this just like a, um, what is that? I can't tell by the map what that is. It looks like there's some sort of a structure there, but... Hi! <gasps> Hi, giraffes! Oh, you're so cute! <laughs> oh, my God, you're adorable! Look at you! <laughs> I don't know if I can tame them. Hi. I don't think I can. Uh, maybe is there like a book for naturalists? Let's see. Mm, a teddy bear. Um, no, I don't see a book. Oh, wow, it got dark fast. I'm not sure how I can tame them. If I can tame them, or like. What would happen if I tamed them? Like, are they rideable? Like, I guess they don't fight. They're giraffes. What's this? I think I see a spawner. Um. Oh, but I see coal. What? Oh, okay, I got it. Oh gosh, I hear a bunch of spiders. What is this? I'm gonna get my butt handed to me if I- whoop. I do want this though, that's pretty cool looking. Oop. What is all this? The cobwebs. I love that sound. So satisfying. That. That. Oh, that filled up my bag? Okay. Um, I'll grab this as well. Then we can grab some of the coal that's here. That's the one thing that I don't like about Inmiss is there's no inventory sort button for your backpack. Has me a bananas. Maybe I should grab some coal too. I oh right, I don't have vein miner right now. All right, where'd that coal go? Oh, I'm like thoroughly checking for creepers. <laughs> don't need any more surprises. Oh, there's coal here too. Very nice. Wow, it feels so weird to break the blocks one by one. I'm very spoiled with the vein miner. We will get there eventually though. And that is a lot of spiders. We're just gonna try to avoid being over there because I'm not sure I... They look a little different than the normal spider icon, which means they might be poisonous, which is even worse. And I really don't want to have to run all the way back here for my stuff, so... Um, do I want to venture... Oh, I see. So it's like a little, um... Almost like a little arena thing over there. I didn't really come out with the intention of 
doing any crazy fighting right now. But, you know, my curiosity is getting the better of me. I really want to know what that is. If it has any loot, because that would be quite helpful right now. Ooh, those ambient sounds are are something. Soapstone is so cool looking. There's so many really, really cool looking black blocks. And the fact that like there's this sand that you can get at the volcanoes, or not sand, dirt or whatever it is, and you can turn it into a farm plot is just so cool. You're gonna have like the coolest looking farm. Um, how do I get out of here? <laughs> Alright. The old fashioned way. Alright, which way was I going? Um, do we want to go. Uh, where is the house? Did I not even mark? Oh, I didn't even mark where my temp house is. Here. Oh, that dead. I guess not. There we go. Okay, so right now I am pretty much completely east. Um, do I want to go south and then kind of loop around maybe and see? Let us take a look. Oh, this is a completely new- <laughs> I completely spaced out, didn't even realize this was a new village. So, uh, thank you for the waystone. <laughs> Excuse me. Jesus. Okay. I will take some of these melons. Thank you. Good, thank you. But at least I know where to come and get the cool looking, um, savannah villagers. These are definitely my second favorite villager outfit compared to the, uh, not compared to, but um, next to the swamp villagers. I mean, I'm slightly biased because, you know, purple, but <laughs> they still look pretty cool. Hello, little bee. Oh, yeah, that's right. And these friends and foes uh, beehives make the beekeeper, which will be super handy for um, beeswax when I want to make wax copper for the Eden... Eden ring um portal <gasps> elephants these are pretty easy to make though so i don't need to steal that one plus i don't have silk touch and i don't want to anger any little bbs i will take this thank you i'm pretty sure the elephants if they're the same ones i'm thinking of they, um, they breed with the azalea flowers, but I'm not sure if that's just Alice's mod or not. Because there's no, like, a uh, book or whatever for naturalist. <laughs> They're so cute, though. Are those warthogs? What are you? A holler? Oh my gosh. There's so many cute animals. Is that noise? <laughs> it sounds like a, a, a pug, like a snoring pug. <laughs> oh my god, it's so cute. Let me sleep, please. I want to go see the warthogs. Oh, they're boars, not warthogs. I'm sorry, my bad. Are you going to be like bears? No? Okay. 
All right. Um, I think I'm gonna try to get a. I don't even know how to say this tree. Baobab. Baobab. Bao. I don't. Uh, <laughs> words. Um, this thing. Bao. Baobab. Baobab. Wait, this is from Wild or Wild? I thought these were from a different mod because I remember seeing these in a different mod as well. Did they have like their own version of them new? Huh. Color me confused. Will this break the whole- Whoa! Okay! <laughs> Do these make bee sounds? Um, it does make bee sounds. That's confusing. I'm hearing them over here too. Uh... Is my game broken? <laughs> I'm confused. Oh, another village. Okay. <laughs> I'm so. Oh, no. Did you guys hear that rhino sound? Okay, I won't go near your baby. Okay. Okay. Ah, it's charging. Okay. Oh, I thought I saw it starting to charge. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, that little baby sound. Oh, I'm sorry. I won't go near your baby. It says these are wild or wild trees, but the wild or wild ones don't make saplings. And these drop nuts and not fruit. So I am super confused. Super duper confused, but I guess we'll just have to see if we find some more in the wild somewhere. Hi friends. I'm sorry, I need to take this. Oh, you shut the door on yourself, silly. Hello. Um, may I have this? Thank you. Alright, and there's a waystone there. Oh, we're, we are coming out uh, with a few waystones today. Uh, get rid of that. And I don't want any of this because I don't even like the wood. I just wanted to see if I could get the fruit. I, I'll keep the nut, I guess. Hello. You got any goodies in here? Ooh, I will take the emeralds. Thank you. <clears throat> I do need to find one more diamond so I can upgrade my backpack as well. Um, there seems to be quite a few villages in this area. That's actually not bad. So, do we want to head back towards the house? Maybe go just a little more south? There's a hill there. I'm gonna grab one of these so I can bone meal them. Oh! Hello. Again. <laughs> oh, right, yeah. Efficiency six. Right, right. Um, not at the moment, my friends. Thank you, though. That. Which way was I going? South? Grab some of these moo moos along the way. Oops. That was a terrible crit. Blink. I do have to get a little villager area set up, but I really don't want to do that right now until I can get the leads made, and I'm pretty sure. Oops. To make the mob catcher leads, I need diamonds, yeah. So we might have to go mining because um I don't want to put together a village area without those leads. I'm not going to collect those flowers just yet because I don't really have anywhere to put them. I have this like just undying need to just explore constantly and I, it really hinders <laughs> getting any progress done sometimes because I just want to see all the pretty things and experience all the stuff but 
I know I am on a mission for iron and coal right now, so at least I have an excuse to kind of um, explore and look around while I do that. Hello, little sheep. Up some more onions. No, thank you. Maybe I'll grab some of the pumpkins as well. Oh, that's another... Wait. Oh, it's in the water. I was like, wait, there's water? <laughs> that close? I couldn't even be bothered to look at the mini-map, apparently. Duh. Okay, so I think we've hit- ooh, that's a lot of rainbow sand though. Ooh, and I forgot there's so much over there too. Okay, so yeah, at least we know where we're gonna come when we want rainbow sand. Do I have my boat on me? I do, but I do know that I'm gonna go back to the house first and dump off some of the stuff. Let's do that for now. And I will go empty my bags real quick here, and then I will come back and we can go and adventure some more. Alright, so let's head back on over. Just explore a little bit longer, and then we'll try to figure out kind of like a little storage building here, maybe. Might as well stay in this area for the time being. I don't think we're actually going to live here. I kind of like to wait until I run into somewhere that kind of stands out to me that looks like somewhere really nice to kind of build and set up. Alright, so just another another windmill. Oh my gosh, this game just really wants me to have those windmills. We'll go and explore them at some point, but the um, little zombie villagers that you see at the bottom are really fast. They like run full force at you, so I'm not really in a position to be fighting them at the moment. I'm still pretty bare. <gasps> there it is. Okay, so this is, I definitely have to put a waist on here because this black kind of soot stuff is amazing for building. Um, these grass blocks here you can turn into farmland, which is super cool. Um, how big is this one? It's actually quite large. There's more sand. There's the black sand there. So there's different types of black sand as well, which is really nice. There's like the kind of like grayish black um, from Biomes Go. And then there's this really dark black sand from um, Terrestria. I just have this like obsession with different building blocks. <laughs> I love it so much. It's a nightmare for storage, but totally worth it. Like, look at how cool that looks. The volcanic rock and like the black sands. It just, it looks, oh my gosh. Or sorry, <laughs> the volcanic rock and the grass and then the, the black sand on top of that right here. Like, look at that. It's just, the textures are so cool looking. All right, so let's see what's this way. We'll come back for some of that beautiful, beautiful stuff in a little bit. I really just want to explore. What's this? Huh? Oh, is this, um, one of those like big villager kind of things just, but it's on the water? Oh, cool. Oh, it is. Oh, very cool. Okay, so at least we know this is by the um, the volcano waystone. Oh, how am I gonna get in there? Ugh. Like this. One day I'm gonna have a full chest on that boat. And I'm, I'm not gonna remember. <laughs> I'm gonna smack the boat and everything's gonna go flying everywhere. Is this one of the boats that has the... Oh, no, I don't think it is. Because I know there's like um, a set of boats in here that have pillagers and stuff on them. 
And they have the, um, the alleys or alleys or however you say it. How do I get in here? Uh, do I just uh, block it my way up here? Oh, hello, friend. All right, I will grab these books. Oh, I'm gonna lose my axe in a second. Alright, alright, because I don't like acacia wood. Um, <clears throat> I mean, I guess I could just make an iron one for now. And do this quicker. I don't know, I know it's coming and it still startles me. Meat. Oh, thank you for the fishies and stuff. Very cool. There should be a chest down this hallway somewhere. If I remember correctly. Hidden in one of these little side things. Uh, unless it's only like a specific one that spawns them. Um... Yeah, this doesn't seem to have it. Okay. Some of them do, some of them don't. Um, but a lot of these spawn bigger too, from what I think I remember. <laughs> uh, but I could be very, very wrong. And thinking of a completely different mod, knowing me. Um, upstairs, stairs, there we go. I s oh, I missed a bugger fish. Oh, I guess my bag was full. That's right. Hello. Um. Don't mind me. I know. I'm sorry. I know. I'm stealing your books. I'm terrible. I'm sorry. So that is all looted. So. Oops. Um. I guess we can go south a little bit more. Where's my boat? Oh, there. Oh my gosh. Totally thought I was not gonna break my ankles there, but apparently I was very, very wrong. So, there's um, some stone over here. So these little hills here, these little mounds sometimes have some coal. I think I got a bit of coal already though. I'm really on the hunt for iron and lapis. Oh, schneels. All right, so I guess we could go this way. What's that? Oh, probably a pillager. Outpost. Now that I see the arch. Okay. Hello, drowned. You don't see me. Please don't have a trident. Oh, there's so much coal. Gib. bit of coal. What I'd like to uh, try to find is some of the ruined portals as well because a lot of the time some of that stuff will spawn in with mending on it and I can just yoink that off. Make myself a diamond pick. I don't have to keep making some uh, iron stuff all the time.
what I saw. I did. That was such a pleasant... <laughs> oh, the pick breaks and I get a, a joyous jingle from my experience. I don't know if... I, oh, gosh. Um, I really don't want to scale all the way down there just to get that coal. I really, really want to find some iron, though. And honestly, it's so much more lucrative to find a nice big mountain other than, um, well, I guess mining still is pretty good, but I find, at least for me, getting it through finding a mountain tends to be a little easier. Well, easier when you can find a mountain. <laughs> That's the, it's pretty much like up to luck at that point, but yeah. Yeah, we got quite a bit of coal. I just realized that we got a wither rose. I'm guessing that was from one of the chests. Okay, so the, yeah, there's a huge mountain right there. Perfect. Perfect. Tinker around there for a sec. I'm trying to find us a... Wow, words. Try to find ourselves a little bit of iron. Now we just gotta make our way over there. That is quite the climb. There's more coal here. I think I can, you know, do the whole coal thing later on when I'm winding down my day. But for now, we can just grab this last one here. And go up here and see if there's any um, iron that's gonna be exposed or anything like that. Why am I hearing flies like there's a dead body or something? That's a glitch in the matrix there. <laughs> All right. Let's see. You got any exposed iron for me, my friends? Hmm. No, I got some snow that look that would have been bad. I see some on the side of the hill, but I really, really don't want to go digging for that. Sometimes like you'll get lucky and there'll be some at the top. Um so that's what I'm hoping for. Okay, so yeah, there is all the beautiful iron that <laughs> I don't know why that gets me like other days doesn't bother me but for whatever reason when I'm under the weather I'm so jumpy oh and there's oh I see emeralds not that you know I have fortune for it or anything but wow there is a lot of coal here there's a whole other oh my gosh So she's not going to get any more coal, proceeds to get more coal. You know what? <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> I'll take it. Mine! Uh, iron? Thank you. This is what I truly came here for. And uh, thank you. Oh my gosh, there's going to be so much. Almost missed that one. Oh, hear more spooters. Where? That is like really close. It's gonna be like right below me. Uh, 
That's a creeper. That's so scary. It's like it's right. It has to be right below me. Because I can definitely hear the pitter patter of those little feet this time. Where are you? This is one of those situations where my curiosity is literally gonna get me killed. So I think what I'm gonna do, <laughs> excuse me, is I should probably put this up here anyways, because this is um, a good spot for fortuning coal and stuff, so. Although, have I just used up all of- no, I haven't. Alright. Let's be curious, cats, and see what's uh, going on down below here. Sounds like they're right next to me, so... That's so bizarre, but... Oh? No? I'm confused. Oh, wait, there we go. Aha! I don't have a bow. Hi, friend. Oh, I can't get you. Ugh. I can't cheese this, can I? Dang it. I was hoping I could, like, smack them from up there, but... Where'd that spider go? Eh? You're not really my enemy right now. It's daytime. Oh, there they are. Hi. What? Oh my god! Ah! <laughs> I didn't realize there was a third one! Oh god, I'm so sorry if that was loud, you guys. I moved my head forward. I thought it was just the two. <laughs> and then the other one got launched towards me. <laughs> I panicked and then the third one came. <laughs> oh my god. This is uh, the exposed iron I was hoping for. Which is nice. Exactly what I wanted. Because that way I can uh, stop using stone tools at least. Oh, I hear a little friend. Ooh, and there's emeralds too. Look at all of this. Oh my gosh, this is great. I'm going to try not to take it all right now though, because um, I'd prefer to come back with uh, with fortune on a pickaxe. I heard him. Where'd he go? must be underground or something okay yeah so I'm gonna leave most of this now because I want to come back with the fortune pick and we're gonna go kind of uh, dig down at our house kind of make like a little diamond type mine I'm obviously gonna cut out <laughs> the painful digging to the diamond level itself because that's just complete you know it's gonna take a little bit but once we actually get to the mining level, then uh, we will come back and go mining for some diamonds. Okay, where are we gonna start this mine? Um, I 
I guess I could do it in here. Oh, this is gonna take a while. Oh, are you serious? One block I break. Actually, you know what? Probably keep that there, actually. Mm. Gonna end up bonking my head. There we go. That's better. We've only gone about this far, and I've already had to battle a bunch of water moving around a bunch of water that has shown up, so... Um, yeah, <laughs> it's gonna be a bit of an adventure getting down to diamond level, but uh, we are going to work our way down there. I need some diamonds to be able to make those leads, because I really, really, really want to get some villagers ready so I can trade with them and get some... Um, chance going because oh my gosh it is so freaking painful <laughs> as many of you know I'm sure I would really love just uh, just like three or four pieces of lapis please just three or four pieces that's all I ask for I just want to make a magnet there is oh I was looking at the map, but that absolutely works. 15 pieces. Let's go. All right. Uh, time to go make a magnet. Uh, do I have enough to actually make it? I need iron, four lapis, four redstone. I do. I do. I do. I do. Yes. Let's do this. Sweet. Thank you. Oh, that's just absolutely beautiful. Thank you, game. All right, back down to diamonds. This is gonna take a while without vein mining. A whole long while. And I love this kind of a grind. Like, I could just sit here for hours and do this, but when you're recording a video, it's like, you don't want to be sitting here for three to four hours just grinding away. But yeah. I'll bring you guys back when I find something, I guess. <laughs> or like, I don't know, something interesting. <laughs> okay, well I just mined for like a solid 30 minutes and couldn't find any freaking diamonds. So um, we're gonna go and try to find some ruined portals. So let's see if we have any I think there's one here, but I'm pretty sure we've already been to that one, so... Um... Let's... I don't think I've seen any along the way here. I really, really need to find some enchants, so... Let's see... Wait, I thought I marked... I did mark this. I marked a volcano. What the heck? Okay, so what's this one? Where's this one? Oh, that's where I ended it. Okay, so you know what? Let's just continue this way then. I think I was going north, right? Well, let's see if we can keep our eyes peeled for um, a ruined portal. One day I'll remember not to- oh! What are- 
are you doing all the way out there? With no hut. Oh, I hate those illusionists. So, oh, there is. There's kind of like a little camp there. We'll kind of mosey our way on over here. those ones where there's something in the middle? Nope. Just uh, random ruins. And I think that is- oh is that another one of those village thingamabobbers? I think yes it is. All right let's see if they have any goodies in there. This is just I think a random broken down abandoned house. I don't think there's any S here or anything. Hey, Momos! Let's go on over here. Oh, does this one have... Oh, it's got three hallways. Okay. So like as I said before, they spawn with different hallway lengths. So we can see if there's any um any goodies. Oh, get him, Gollum. If there's any goodies down these hallways here. Oh. Have a little sleep first. Okay. You guys got any goodies here? Ooh, the Matrix fish looks cool. <laughs> so cute! Got some veggies. Although I think I already grabbed a bunch of potatoes. Alright, um, so there are other hallways. So we've already been down that hallway. <gasps> there, there's a chest there. I probably should have emptied my bag. That might have been smart. Um, I don't think we got really anything of significance there. Let's see if there's any more chests down this way. Mm, nope. Okay. We've got one more we can check. So I don't think that one usually has anything in it. Oh, well, apparently it does. Uh, I couldn't have been more incorrect. Holy guacamole. Okay. Okay, so I had the complete opposite in mind here. Or is this... Oh, is this one of the ones where it's got the baddies in it? Oh, I'm nervous. Oh, is this the one with like the invisible guys? Hmm. Or am I just really lucky and got a good villager? Oh, okay, maybe it's not. Oh. Oh, okay. I stand corrected. Again. <laughs> Alright, what do we get? We got a slime ball. Pumpkins. Yeah, nothing really that I'm looking for, but we'll take. And then we'll go check upstairs and see if any of those guys have, um... I don't have any more waystones. Oh, I have one. Maybe I can just roll you guys here. And just try to get vein miner or something because... Yeah. Any chests? Um, I'm debating, but yeah, but then I would need emeralds, and then I'd have to 
set up farmers here as well. And I really don't want to do that. I don't want to have to do this all so far away from home. So I'm just going to take this. Oh, that's not what I wanted. At least I got some lecterns and stuff, which is good. Okay, well, back to our adventure. Oh, there's nice pretty grass up there. Let's go this way. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Ouch. Ouch. I can go across the pretty bridge. Oh, but you bonk your head on. What's this? What's this? Like this. Interesting. It's just like a random little tree house. Pretty grass. I've seen a lot of these biomes already, but I guess the generation of them just makes them just ever so slightly different. And uh, just love the contrast of the grass. So pretty. Especially when it's around like that really deep grass. Oh, and there's those witch woods I was talking about as well. Grab some of those. Because the green is very pretty, but the um it's not the color of these ones that bothers me. It's the the change of the pattern of the wood. So, of course. Like see this like it's it's still nice colors and stuff, but it's I think it's like the yellow that's throwing me off. I'm not sure. All right, well, that, that's all that took. <laughs> Ooh, I will get some of these too, these focus ones. All right, we have no bag space. Oh, I lied, what am I talking about? Got a whole other bag right here. Oops, and I accidentally put my... What's it, crafting table? Okay. Oh, it's raining. Um, well, explore for a little while longer to see if we can find... Oh, that's really pretty. Uh, if we can find anything, um, and then I'll have to end the episode for today because we've been going for quite a while. I don't want to be given hubby five hour long videos to go through. Plus my throat needs a break. It's uh, not having a good time. Oh, that is just... There's my water. I tried it. Oh, I forgot. Apparently, you can water log leaves. Oh yeah, and that's another thing about the witch hazel. The leaves used to look completely different. They were like this beautiful golden color and like the sparkliness was like a... Just an ever so slightly different colored like sparkly flower 
And now it's just, I don't know, it just doesn't, I don't know. I can't do what I'm trying to do here and it's not working. Um, let's do this then. But yeah, um, I don't know, it's just little details like that. Like the bark is beautiful and these colors are really pretty, but I miss the old leaves too. I know I'm complaining about the most like insignificant stuff, but <laughs> I like to build with them before and now I just, I don't want to build with those. I might use the wood because it's very, very like uh, green, but actually let me see if the planks look any different. Uh, where did I put the wood? Yeah, that, let's see. Oh yeah, they're still pretty green. Um, let's go this way. Oh, is this the aspen? Yeah. I think these planks are like a, yeah, kind of like a salmon-y pink color. Some of those. Um, I don't see any portals. Oh, it's not quite time to sleep. It's just uh, brainstorming out. Interesting looking like granite structures over here. What are these trees? Is this Zakova? Yeah. Hello, little foxes. All right, everyone. Thank you so much for watching the second video in my solo Minecraft series. Um, I appreciate you being here and for all of the love on the other video and the videos before that as well. I really appreciate you coming to check out the content and I hope you enjoyed um, watching as much as I enjoy making it. I do apologize again for being a little under the weather and not being my usual bubbly self. Um, hopefully I'll be back to normal or normal-ish next week and um, we can get on with the fun at that point as well. So I hope you have a very happy holiday and spend um, or very happy holidays and spend a lot of time with your friends and family and uh, get time to relax and everything. So yeah, I will see you guys next week and I hope you are all doing amazing and do amazing and remember to hydrate. <laughs> Take care. Bye.